everyone and welcome back to the Arsenal Bunker today. It's away days. It's Brighton versus Arsenal. Cannot wait for this one. Absolutely bug. I'm just about to go now. I'm going 2-0 Arsenal. No, 2-1 Arsenal. Sorry, I think they're going to score first. But Yang brace is happening today, ladies and gentlemen. About to get on the train now. About to start our journey. It's about 12, 1... No, it's like nearly 1 o'clock, but... Come on, you gunners. So, it is currently 20 to 2. We're at London Victoria now. We've got ourselves a cheeky little Mackies. Lovely juggling. Uh, train. It's about, it's about 40 minutes to like, uh, so have to get it. Gonna get on the train, about an hour and 20 minutes sort of journey, something like that. And then, uh, yeah, we'll be up and playing. I've got a bit more my train after that. But we'll just, we'll just get on with that as we go. We're gonna have this Mackies now. I wanna find somewhere to sit down. I don't even wanna stand up and eat it. You know what I mean? But yeah. We're at London, Victoria, nearly there. Come on, you gunners. Also, some very good news. Man U are drawing one all currently with Everton. So, very, very good stuff. To, uh, hopefully, it stays one all, even a 2 1 Everton. So, yeah. Arsenal oh, get three points, two points off the top of the league, ladies and gentlemen. We are on our way back up. The Goonies are coming back. You heard it here first. And I think my train is just about to pull up. So, let's get on it. On the train, Everton have just scored, but it's offside. Painful, but on the train, it's all that matters. Leaving in about 10 minutes, so yeah. We are now in Brighton. Now we've got to get one more train and then we're right next to the ground. Let's do this. We are terrible weather. Terrible, terrible weather. Spread the 1-0 win today. Aubameyang with the winner. Hopefully he can continue his goal score. I like the positivity and also having a clean sheet. So thank you very much. Hopefully we get the win. Oh, shoot! Pepe! Kieran! 
Get it away, get it away. Go on! No! Fuck him! Fuck him! No, no. Really not good enough. Terrible game. Oh, what a block. Oh, what a save by Ramsdale. Again, free header again. Should have scored. Terrible. They ain't kicking it out though, are they? Come on, Pepe! Come on! Pepe! So it's finished, Arsenal nil, Brighton nil. So boring, so cold, so wet. Just one of the worst games in Premier League football, surely. Very, very boring game, but we love the Gunners. International break now. Listen, I think they deserve to win, guys. We really weren't good tonight, but listen, you can't be good every game, so I'm gonna go home now. I'm gonna try and speak to a few fans after the game, see what they think, but yeah, not good enough from the boys tonight. So I'm with Kalechi, end of the game, nil nil. Very disappointing. What do you think? Yeah, it's a point of result. I was expecting three points, so can you know, lose the gap to the top. Yeah. But it didn't happen. But, um, and I think we deserve to lose as well, personally. I think we personally deserve to lose. <laughs> we rode our luck a few times. That's, that's what I'm trying to put it. But um, overall, um, I mean, they didn't really have clear cut chances, to be honest. Yeah, it was, I think it was quite a style game. Yeah, overall. it was a style game overall. Very style game. Um, yeah, so, which is reminiscent to the way that we yeah. had. So, yeah. yeah. Uh, can't, we can't go emotional with all Vieira coming back to the Arsenal and all that stuff. It's business as usual, so we'll just go and get the three points. Definitely agree. Thank you, Kletchi. Seb, obviously we didn't speak before the game, but after the game, nil nil, very, very stout performance. Uh, I think most of the fans aren't happy with the performance, definitely. But I think a point from our performance in that game is good because I thought we are on to the other side. It's not as if Brighton were, had should have scored or something like that. If there was not many chances that you could go, we should have scored there, should have scored there. But honestly, I think they should have it overall. Yeah, definitely. We didn't have we didn't have the races to do. It was nothing compared to last week. The defence, I thought, did their job at the back because we felt good resilience to keep that clean sheet and some of the blocks and some of the tackles at the back and Ramsdale again was good. But overall, we didn't do enough today to win that game. And it's rather disappointing because I kind of thought Ryan would possibly be able to take it. Yes, it was a good start, but they had no no Casuna. And yeah, they were very wasteful with it. They were wasteful with their chances. And these are the things that we had to the catch once we had chances. Sorry, I got a bit calf there, but um, what I can say, what you just said there about the defence, I definitely agree. The defence were strong today. I think they were strong. So you've got to get the defence credit, but attacking wise, we weren't great. I think Odegaard was very quiet today. Very, very quiet. Ben Smith, I was trying to make things happen. Uh, uh, and Obama Yang and Saka looked very off the races today. But hopefully, we've got Palace next. That's in. Well, it's over two weeks, it's on yeah, a Monday night, yeah, but we've got to go into that now and win. Definitely, we, we have to play a lot better than we did than yeah. we did today, because again, they're going to they're gonna sit back and defend and exactly. try and count. 100%. Cheers, Seb. Thank you. No worries. Thank, thank you, Seb. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you did like it, smash that like button. It's free. Smash the subscribe button. It's free. And then when you press subscribe, turn on notifications. It's also free. Comment down below. Honestly, guys, thank you so much for watching. It's been a pleasure being an Arsenal fan today. An absolute pleasure. Thank you so much for watching. I'm out. Peace out, guys.